Hey everyone, it's Q here. Welcome to the channel. If you found it, I got a book there, so I'll read that. Um, I'm just trying a new format here, so I'm trying to transform with the death card there. So let's pop this to the side and see what the book came out. Do this book. All right, sweet. We have Calm Waters with the Six Swords going towards the truth and gaining independence. Hmm, music. Wielding truth with will wisdom instead of letting the thoughts in our head say what is, but also learning how to mm, only give love when love is received. Uh, unreciprocal love is despair. Uh, as the King of Wands comes out, mm, are you being forceful of your way or are you being somebody that's nurturing something and grabbing your passion of your Empress, the card of creation? Or are you deceiving them instead of looking up? What are they your wish? Hmm. Hmm. Being sequestered away and observing what one actually finds to be important, nurturing, uh, worth nurturing. Seven Pentacles there. Hmm. I guess that works. Um, has made one self-evaluate by wielding truth that one avoided truth the whole time so one could mm, dance among crows. Uh, having it their way. So this energy sits alone here. Uh, that's why I decided not to do that. It's too much in increase to much gravity. It is a better angle. Uh, but yeah, the Empress, the card of creation, is worth nurturing and pouring love into. And see, even the geese are flying to her. <laughs> uh, but this king here has went from giving the full cup always to making sure it's worth doing so. Mm, and same thing with the king here. They face the truth, now they can wield the truth. But the owl's perched up on there. Suggesting listening to one's intuition. And one can enjoy this world just by themselves. But if you nurture and hold close to truth, hmm, the crowing and the cawing from these crows, magpies, ravens, uh, won't bother you. You're nurtured by warmth of that swan taking you to truth and that warmness this is the warmness mm. fuck you George that's alright I'm transformed from this shit or die so it was said to me for talking about how your behaving is making me feel. I deserve death. Yeesh. <laughs> Let's talk about what you deserve. Mm. It certainly isn't something like that. What are we talking about? That's why he says shit like that. Because <laughs> he's terrified of that. Yeah, it overwhelms him to be real. Oh my god, you talked something. Uh, I'd respond if you said something worth talking about. Yeah, please leave. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. 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 I'm good. Need you didn't really want you and keep pushing that on me because who wants who? Get back in the water. And that poor individual that you just made me nothing for because I guess they got to you and well I became wrapped in cellophane put in the fridge again. <laughs> oh, bless your heart. Oh. That's just the surface level only. 
want to go into the depths of what I actually know this to be. King of Darkness. Wishing to get their wish fulfilled with all that bling. Bling, 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 bling. So they can live comfortably. Mm. Live comfortably at the expense of what? And what's glowing right there? Five, two, five. Yeah, the Empress. You are resolved. You have your resolve to manipulate and get what you want no matter what. Yeah, no matter what. Even if it's death. Of your embers. That's the secret that you'll never face and look at. But they are. Maybe you'll do it in that Leo new moon that's coming up that wasn't worth responding to either. Fucking give me a break. Um, I almost made it through an eight minute video of. I did say something, I was like, oh, I said it very subtly of. The best way to learn something is by learning what something is not. And it pulled circled into, well, he was doing it. So I thought I'd put it on so he at least know what he's doing and what he's not doing. Gaslighting. Thank you, Dr. Ronnie. That motherfucker <laughs> tried to weaponize it to push his narcissism on. Then question my sanity or sobriety level to get his point across, which is literally mentioned in the video. Uh, bless his heart. He's just a fucking fool. But I know that. It's an act, so he doesn't have to actually act. Like he has an intelligent brain. Because it's better to just play the fool if you're made to be a fool and you don't have to be accountable if you just act like you're an idiot. Am I the only one that sees you? This Queen of Cups. It's always just a bitch. You remembered every single fucking word. But you wouldn't say story. Because that was the point. Yes, a little smirk thing. As you literally are complaining to me about not liking that same phenomenon done to you. And you're trying to be chill. You want to complain about all your stuff to which I could never have done, and there you are doing, it's impossible. You create an impossible scenario, so you get the reaction that you want. Reactionary abuse. One hundred and seventy-eight pages. You almost added another paragraph to die by trying to use gaslighting as a weapon. Like the definition of it. Uh, yeah, sure. Watch all the content. Please do. Uh, you can watch all the content of Dr. Romney and various other many people because we're all talking about it because, well, everybody's drawing a fucking line in the sand. Yeah, Stop. Or you're an animal. Are you an animal or are you a human? When I'm cool that, or you're just a fucking bacteria. If I don't get, I don't survive. Well, we created civilization. So we would stop feeling that way. You know what it took? Putting that down for a micro moment. 
those brave, brave souls that are willing to step up and try something different at their risk of detriment. Why? For them. Because it don't benefit me none. Oof, I don't know why this became a divine lecture, but here it is. So I'm tired of every time I try to... And this ain't just him. That's why I tried to explain him too. I was like... It's not just you. To which he said, oh, it must be you. No, just... What is the percentage now worldwide? Um, those that are dominated by that energy, because everyone should face that we do have all a narcissistic core of an ego. It is our duty, responsibility to transcend that and temper it and make it the pet that it is and not the thing that we are. Because ironically, the thing that's trying to make you survive is deleting the things that help you survive. Putting you out in the cold. So, here's some truth, swiftly, about those illusions of the horrible N-word. The one that we can't say and we have to say antagonistic or if we say narcissism, they get all scoffed up in their butthole and immediately call me, which Now the difference was that I showed him because I agreed to that. That would never come out of his mouth. I was like, you know what? We do all have a narcissistic core of ego. I ain't demonstrating that right now. I've made my dragon a cute little pet. And I throw it off the bridge every day. Because it would do the same to you. Just to be ready. It's lucky I feed the damn thing. This is all it ever does. Half the shit. 70. 93%. And what was the other one? Oh, yeah. Uh, narcissistic core people have. 80% worldwide. 80, 81, 82, 83. 82. At 83. 82% of the population of the world is dominated by and you can go down the steps and just read. the United States of America the population of it is dominated by mm, <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 50, 51, 52 51% of the people 49% of the people. So 50, one out of two, five out of 10 would sacrifice you for keeping face with 51% whatever number I said, with people that don't care what you're saying to keep a face it's just snake eating its own tail. It's just so... Keep boundaries up, guys. Once they show you when to fucking kill them down. They can't change. They can't. I cannot find that video of Hawkins doing the same very thing. I wish I could. Because at the, during the video, he looks at the dude and he says, I'm doing something that no one will ever do for you. Now the conversation's over. Get up. Leave. No. The conversation is over. I've never been so turned on. <laughs> this 80-year-old man just wrecking the fuck out of him. Thanks, Todd. It was a miracle. Yeah, see, red flag them. They tend to be Leos. This is personal and such, but not always the case. Some people can temper them 
the fire signs are having a really, really hard time because the world just transitioned into cups. And I don't have to speak louder here, aren't I? You'll figure it out. What did we start with? I thought we started with a student. Oh, I'm collaborating. I'm getting all kinds of weird energy out of here. 1515. I don't want to post this. It's just for me to rant, I guess. So I don't fucking know. I like being able to see the time again, though. <laughs> it was hard to do a minute videos like that. It was really hard. I just kind of got the rhythm. I was like, oh, no, too long. Oh, no, too long. <laughs> and I was a tatty Cathy when I first started this. I'm making 45 minute videos. Psh, I'm gonna watch that shit until they know you. <laughs> Which, I might have to go back and watch some. Some of them are pretty funny. <laughs> uh, why? Because it ain't me doing this stuff. I just open up the wire and let it flow. Because the moment I get in my head and start trying to think about it, it just all gets the shit. So, that's just uh, some divine advice. But what the hell do I know? By virtue of that, I can let that energy flow into me. That's how I do it. So if I was to ask my human, this is my human state pretty much always. But I'm not this. I'm that butterfly. That light of creation coming in. Trying to transform that little person. Hmm. Burn it down. It'll have to. It'll have to change then. It ain't got nothing left. <laughs> That's a little dramatic. Sometimes that's what it takes. That doesn't sound very divinity. And you claim to know what that is. Yeah. Totally get your gripe with that. But as I am hanging out with things that had never ever had choice, um, everything in this realm that we like people don't know shit about it it's nothing like what you would think nothing to all those that eventually get there chuckle and laugh at what I put there <laughs> I wonder if it'll get the visualization. I didn't really get that, I just got my knowingness. But I put that golden heart there. And then I ripped it out of my human. And used it to protect the world from the darkness. Cause it's there. <laughs> There's some dark, 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 That literally want to snuff out light. Because it hurts their eyes. I love tarot. Look how fucking perfect that is. That's why I love tarot. And I'm learning. I don't know. Slow growth, slow learn. But I want to. And I'm willing to change. I'm a divine feminine, but I'm coming into my divine masculine. I may just be a DM now. Am I a runner now? <laughs> I had that question once, and in my OCPD-ness, I evaluated it, and the person that I could have possibly been a runner with, I made sure that I wasn't. Now they're a runner. Uh, I was like, wait a minute. Same thing with narcissism, too. That's how I knew I had it, too. But it don't dominate me. It's pretty much just... It's becoming a tool. It's pretty much like the King of Cups there. Because, well, as we discovered, there's a little... My city is disgustingly 12% have integrity. I don't know what that means for narcissism. It's not everybody's that. They could be like, mm, anything in the B cluster. 
shit right now. I'd take a freaking histrionic. Because they'd be fun. And Christ Watch drugs. They're histrionics. <laughs> Which I improperly got like suggested that that was me one time. No. Confirmation. I have OCPD. It sometimes comes off as narcissistic because of the rigidness, but it's rigid because, well, I put in the work to find out which is the answer, and I always correct my data if put it was into the new data. Just like the noodles on the floor that weren't there. Shit. I wasn't right. I'm sorry I said that. I'm glad there's not noodles on the floor. Instantaneously corrected. Why? I worship truth. I ain't gonna stop. You spit shit lies at me, I'm gonna kill you. I'll just walk away from you. That means you don't value truth. You know what truth is? Real. You know what real is? Love. You know what love is? The divine. God. Flying spaghetti noodle monster. Here's what the divine is for everybody has that confused. And I'll sum it up pretty easily. Just wrap your head around it, maybe. It's not a human. It is the field in which the field arises out of. And it's classically called, now it's gonna be classically, the unmanifest. Because the manifest arises out of the unmanifest. It's where statements like this, even the infinite can overcome eternity. That's an absolute. Wrap your head around that. Here's another absolute. Duh. Uh, and the first one I kicked my toe on and learned about was a cat knows what it is to be a cat by virtue of being a cat. I think about a cat. I ponder about a cat. I can hypothesize about a cat. But only a cat, 22, 22, knows what it is to be a cat. Not a human. A human don't know what it is to be a cat. Only a cat does. So only the divine can know what it is to be divine. By virtue of being divine. Same thing with mm, love, understanding. All oh, the poo-poo were love. <gasps> That's why I've been using real. Now, listen to how ridiculous that is. Us not standing up and just assuming that it's just going to keep on, you know, being fought for by others is why the darkness is trying to take over and overcome. People aren't standing up for it anymore because they're tired of being antagonistically abused. Chop my motherfucking head off and present me to the king and I will sit there and hold my essence together so I can tell you some truth on that fucking platter. Also, I ain't carrying a goddamn cross. Nothing but balls. Right here, right there. And even then, I'll probably hold my brain matter together so I can just give you another lecture because it would just satisfy the divine to put ugh in its place for trying to crown itself it. So yeah, only the divine is what it is to be divine. That's the narcissistic core of Zico's problem. It ain't, but it tries to paint that pretty, pretty picture that it is. You know how you be that? You be it, but just being truth. It's really easy, it's not a fucking shortcut. Why? Why is that the shortcut answer? Because it's real. And what is the divine? The manifest. Not Alice in Wonderland's I say something means what it means. It's relativism. Here it is, people. Everybody's like scared of all these other things. You know what the big scariest thing to come up from modern man was relativism. 2442. A thing means what it means because I say that's what it means. The fuck it does? No. A thing means what it is by virtue of being 
what it is. Yes, languaging is what you're talking about there, but it doesn't change the essence of what it is. A tree is still going to be a tree if I call it a cat or not. That's just you looking stupid. And then when I call you out on looking stupid, because you're by virtue being stupid, I deserve death. Behold, narcissism. Antagonistic. Again, we all have that because we wouldn't be here if we didn't. It's the downside of evolution. We inherited all of creation. <clears throat> to stand right here very now. So thank you. But do you want to stop growing? Because it sounds like y'all all, all want to keep growing by virtue of the bitching. <laughs> uh, uh, yes, I know. I ain't doing that no more. I ain't gonna have to chain myself so I can't be like this. I want you around. Fuck you. You bring truth, real love. No, not sex and cobbling. Who cares? <laughs> this monkey shit. It's not fulfilling. That stuff is interesting when the other things are there. Otherwise, just jerk off and save the world a fucking headache. Ugh. Ugh. I don't know. It's only fun if it's real. But maybe I'm just in my head and stuck with my fingers because the little devil's gone crap. No, I'm looking up, which is classically like, looking towards the divine. You know why we all said that and it's like programmed into our society? Is because when you look up, especially at night, because when that phrase probably came about, we didn't have all the light pollution we could see for quite a while at the vastness of all of creation. So it made us see the something bigger than ourselves is up. Which is a beautiful sentiment. But like most things that are beautiful and point towards the light, it's devalued and weaponized to push an agenda and say what's right. No, it ain't right because you said it is. It's right by virtue of being You can literally stick a thermometer up its ass to know what temperature it is. If you put a th thermometer to an ice cube there, it would say a certain temperature, would it not? Or at least have a threshold in order to be ice, it must be this. Or could I say liquidity water is ice? Of course I could say that. It wouldn't make me right. It just made me an idiot. I started with him, but you know, it came to everybody else. Even myself. It's just good memory jogging of everything I've fucking learned. Trying to get away from the monkey ego. But don't get away from it because secret, it never goes away. And when it does, and you don't even identify with it anymore, it becomes a persona. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> it was a goddamn trap. <laughs> Enlightenment is nothing like what they said. <laughs> non attachment, ultimate, is nothing like what you would ever think it is. What was it? Peace is boring. By virtue of being what? Peace. But that stops. That's not the ultimate. That's not an absolute. That's a limitation. So, oh, that'd be awesome if I just scrapped it immediately. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
the divine just wrecked me. Just shut up, for fuck's sake. So, we're designed to suffer. And only a cat knows what it is to be a cat by virtue of being a cat. I love it. Uh, truth. Oh, jeez. Uh, I'm looking for, um, I don't even know what I was looking for. I don't know. <clears throat> Trying to learn. I like the scene, too. <laughs> they did. Legal threats. Summer. <clears throat> Drugged intended to. <laughs> Usually, as we discovered, 82% of the population would not care. The alone is too real. And that's how all creation happened. Unconditional love. Hidden intent. That was in the energy field of strength and power. Above 200. Below 200. Their intentions, though, were malice. No, it wasn't. I say it wasn't. No, it is by virtue of being what it is. Trust me, I didn't want it to be that. But there it sat. It's working out. How's that for a story time? <laughs> uh, it's fun to be. devilish sometimes. <clears throat> I want to go to the forest. I agree. And cry more. You should. Nothing wrong with that? I mean, I'm mean to the damn thing. I make fun of the damn thing because that was not me. And there's that Leo new moon that's coming up. Does Mickey USS? What's holding you back? But only respond to things that are worth responding to. I'm listening to them talk. Uh, geez, yeah, there it is. Wow, beautiful, thank you. <clears throat> to paint lies as verily, uh, verily, truth is to, uh, truth, uh, <clears throat> Thank you, the vine's kicking its ass. Sell it. To paint lies as verily, truth is to, uh, verily truth, there we go. And he's like a comma. Why is that? No, I just did it all crazy like. <laughs> to paint lies as verily truth is to violate one's will choice. I don't know why it was hard to say. I also noted, be gone from me. <laughs> why? Stop attacking my reality. A thing is what it is by virtue of what it is. I ain't buying. Truth. But yeah, to paint lies as verily truth is to violate one's will and choice. Why is that? Because people make choices and their will based off of the information around them. If you are selling them lies as truth, then when they call you out on what's clearly not, you then tell them no it is, and then question their mental state and capacity to judge what is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to paint lies verily as truth is to rob a choice. Who? Mm -hmm. You too. That's the sad part. And it's just coming from the spleen. Man, that divine's working with me. I need to use these more often. T is wrath. My intentions are above 200. I'm just new. 
just as bad as the other. I others bear witness, speak the testimony of witnessing. <laughs> Did you know that O2 is a literally fucking miracle? Big F. Fucking miracle. Our star, which warms our planet and keeps life available here, doesn't produce O2. You know what does? Stars that blow up. All of creation is fucking great. Next, next, next. Next thing to transcend, please. Next. <laughs> See, I want to go to a forest. Oh, I should do an episode about that dog whistling. Mm. Just like this, this was the, I said one while I was saying, I'm listening to him talk. Oh, what was it? I'm, I deleted it because I'm just, I'm done. So I just, I'm sure I'll get emailed and another fucking text now number is. Luke, it wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't have mattered. I was going to suffer forever, no matter what. It wouldn't have mattered. So, in my masochism, I suffered so I can gather data, so I can do it for others. And if, if you're informed, maybe you won't suffer. The suffering I've suffered. That's my motivation. Because you don't have to. But you can. And now I've seen this very moment right here, right now. It's today the day. Hmm. Not who I am. Mirror. I are by virtue of actions and intent is what I am. A Q knows what it is to be a Q by virtue of being a Q. And only a Q knows its intent. By their fruits you shall know. I guess I'm a horrible monster. Maybe. <laughs> Help me divine this. And it's all like, oh yeah? Get to the forest and we'll talk. <laughs> Stop trying to get a fake account. Be authentic with yourself. I mean, hi, I'm shit. So stupid. Coffee, tea, mud water, espresso. I'm hat tipping the mud water thing because, well, it checks out with KT. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Woman, what would you have of me? That's a Jesus quote. Yeah. So I'm gonna leave it there at 38, 38. <clears throat> um, I got wrapped up in these because they're awesome. Um, talk to yourself. Fuck it. Record it. Make a podcast. Who cares? This is therapeutic for me. If no one ever watched it. So talk to yourself. But there's no others there. Like I said, there's nothing like you would think in your experience. But if you're hearing clearly something else there, please go get medical help. You can feel what they're saying. That's really shitty languaging. It's about as good as it gets. Um, but you will not hear another... If you are, um, I, mean, I can think of like three different things I could do. But they're all medical. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, I will say this and wrap it up as we hit 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, one. Fuck those eggshells. Crunch, crunch, crunch. And then yell. And don't let them tell you you can't be angry because, well, I'm tired of stepping on fucking claymores. Not even eggshells anymore. It's 
play more or lose legs. I have every right to be angry. You aren't governing my emotions either. Burger King. Gotta have it your way. Fuck you. You get pickles and onions. Extra. They ask for no pickles and onions? Give them extra. Try how you might like them now. No, don't be a dick. And people are more than happy to accommodate, usually. Oh. Here's a closing thought. Be careful not to leave your house empty. If you do leave your house empty, make sure you lock the door because if you're hollow, things will come in and squat. Bulwark, your precious little piece of china. Y'all act like you only got one and you ain't gonna be accountable for anything. Yet think you would take better care of it. Be heard. Be willing to be heard. That's a great energy. Like the backbone of our country. KT it. Because a thing is what it is by virtue of being what it is, but you can't know that unless you got integrity. Because if you did have integrity, you wouldn't want to manipulate it to make you look right. And that's why it works. And it's also gated behind integrity. You can't weaponize it. Like you did that little lecture that you couldn't even make it through. So you'll never learn and I know I'm directing that to a particular individual, but I'm director, directing it to the energy field. Kind of like those orange kitties, like the doctor said. You met one orange kitty, you met all the orange kitties. They're pretty much just orange kitty -ness. Well, there's narcissistic -ness. It's boring, because it's so predictable. get some slightly meager or whatever. You're fucking naive. That's naive. You know what? Back to the start. Maybe cruel or whatever, but whatever. You don't think it exists or has any accountability, so all the way back. Earn the right to be a human again. I just unfortunately know that's just my ego speaking. So I told you it still exists. The truth is, we don't digress, which is why it's becoming rampant. Because while you should digress, we don't. So we still have dinosaurs roaming around the planet, just in these little flesh bags. Stop talking. I told you to shut up. I call it mean daddy. Ugh. The universe just wrecked me. <sighs> Beyond all that, while still being that. Wrap that around here too. I want one more, one more break. Courage. No neutrality. Don't be a lame 78 page book. Boring. We're more than bacteria. Evolve past being a single cell. The cost get at another's expense. Seriously, thanks. We're good now. <laughs> Uh, these are fun because I like write, use the lettering and different colors to say something else. 
Oh, I know why, because it's over here in this one. We'll do it like tarot and see what pops out. Fuck it, it's a long video anyway, I don't care. He gave out my phone number. Snake eating its own tail, survival, evolving, trusting in symbols and faith. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. officer say that isn't it I was like when someone says no and they keep doing it what does it matter what X is I blew his mind because it was right why because a thing is what it is by virtue of being what it is my will is screaming no and you're just doing it anyway Okay, so gift card goons. <laughs> yeah. Hi, everybody. It's Q here. Welcome to my channel if you found it. <laughs> uh, this is going to be a short message of gift card goons, a.k.a. paparazzi. My paparazzi are fun because they're ridiculous. And whatever survival is, right? Just cost you your soul for a gift card. They're real. Don't let anybody gaslight your reality about that because they don't want to face the fact that that's true because a thing is what it is by virtue of being what it is. And when that's their intention and it tastes like that, acts like that, quacks like that, barks like that, <laughs> think, fuck thinking, feel bigger. And then whenever you feel that, make it bigger. We box the infest. <clears throat> Damn, it took me that long to get to it. The infinite God, universe, flying spaghetti noodle monster. The unmanifest, as you should know by the lecture, quiz time. The unmanifest kindly asks you to stop boxing it. How can I be infinite if you keep putting me in a box that I can't grow out of? Step up, people. Stop scapegoating the past. Or it just repeats itself, which is just a rule of history. Everybody's gonna be up in arms about this new Game of Thrones. Remember, remember the shitty ending that no one liked about that one. They all complained about it. I thought it was actually kind of beautiful. It was poorly delivered or whatever. That's an opinion. However, break the goddamn wheel. Unbox the divine, please. God kindly asks you to not force your will on him. If it was personified. It was an anthropomorphized. Good word. <laughs> Spiders. Uh, this has been fun. Um, oh, yeah, here. Here's one that I'll end it off. And I'll clean up the mess later. Mm. Yeah, I totally just want to go home, too. But we'll do it all. Because all fear is an illusion. It's sad that that had to be removed from the ball, but it was being desecrated, so I removed it. The energy field that could deface the pineda. So guess what I put up instead? A pineda. The vine goes, fuck you. <laughs> Rack, bitch. Plus spirituality. It's the way home. When you perish, when this meat sack falls away, where's your home? What would you feel comfortable at? That should evolve too. Just saying. Hence, my lecture rule momentarily there at 50 minutes. <laughs> of the divine... 
politely insist we stop boxing them. Cleanse your energy. That's all you gotta do. Everything can be done with a snap. Didn't I show that? So, um, there's your lecture. I don't know. I'll take it for whatever it's worth. Um, here we'll add some tarot to it. <laughs> It's an ultimate wish fulfillment with someone. The nine is single and solo. The ten is sharing it. The whole reason all of creation actually exists. If it could feel and be a thing, it would just had said, man, I'm lonely. And thus, everything popped into existence. Uh, and several infinite layers of cognitive dissonance. Uh, so that is a tier 8 meta joke. <laughs> Look at that, tens. We got ten cups, ten swords, with the world in between them. Shatter the reality that you think that was there. It wasn't even real anyway. But we polite and not gonna force our will and tell you what is and what isn't. Could you not do the same to us? The world you complain about doesn't even exist. But that only exists at a certain... Mm, gas is only gonna be parent, uh, uh, here amongst us. Water, vapor, gas. If the temperature is at 100 degrees Celsius. It ain't, well, it ain't gonna be there. So unless you're at 100 degrees Celsius, you can't say the statement, the world you see doesn't even exist. Because ice exists, and that's what's there. And by virtue of it, what's there, your statement doesn't see the, the dance, and that's what they try to push on you. Don't worry about that. Just be nice. Golden rule. Just treat people how you want to be treated. Which means you have to not be a hypocrite. And when you are, you go, oops, my bad. I'm sorry, how may I make this better? Because I'm a human and I make mistakes. But I will own it. Versus destroying your sanity. Because if I destroy your sanity, everything you said that was true gets destroyed. No, a thing is, but is what it is by virtue of being what it is. Alice, here's that for the looking glass. Heal that up. There's light. If you just look up. Damn, son. So not only do we get ten cups and ten swords putting it into it, we a card away, a wish away, is ten pentacles. Shattering that world for the illusion that it is. The thing is, and it sucks, is once you know, it can't unknow. And for that, I'm sorry. But trust me, it's better. You literally go through a phase where it's just ecstasy. No drug, no nothing. And you just feel like ecstasy. And then it's replaced by peace. And you're not mad at it. You're like, ah. Oh. Most people perish at that point because it's so peaceful. So why should I breathe? Breathing is like not peaceful. <laughs> and your cells and body go in a universal of ultimate relaxation. I think what is it, fifty percent survive that? Most most don't because mm, in hindsight. Yeah. That road only gets worse. <laughs> After about Mother Teresa, Gandhi. So. Gandhi was only had an okay time because of who he was, but you know, um, the art stands alone. Miracles happen over heartache. All it takes is good hard work. Man, in our fourth, we had complete completion.
if we just nurture ourselves. I like it. <laughs> ten wands, ten cups, ten swords, ten pentacles. All because we had a choice, but a heart dangling, but the swans were telling us where to go the whole time. Face truth, which is the whole thing I started with, with this whole video, mean daddy lecture. Look at my lightning truth. Face truth, come on. Because what does truth lead us to? Real. And what does real lead us to? Love. And what is love? The flying spaghetti noodle monster. <laughs> Bury the shit from the past. As you see, those two other wands are graves now. And grab that ace of wands and go off into something new. So you can feel the warmth and the radiance of truth. Go again, what's truth? <laughs> oh, I didn't notice. Look at that. Right here, dab stab in the middle is a wish. Because we wish to nourish and worship truth. And I didn't realize that I flanked it with the Queen of uh, Swords and the King of Swords. So after one faces truth, one can wield truth with the wisdom and the manifestation energy of the uh, one manifest. Look, behold, I just handed enlightenment to you on a golden platter. Just knock my head off the way for saying the truth. I don't It wouldn't be the first time. Intuition. And fool. So sometimes I do feel like a fool for saying the truth. Because it does get me my head cut off. I have no friends. I have no lovers. It's just me and the divine. And a cohort of demons. Because well, I was like, have you ever been loved? <laughs> no. And what is the lovers in this day? Choice. Imagine this. Because this is hell. Imagine you didn't have a choice and that's all you could be. You could never grow. He's not there. No, you can never grow. No choice, no nothing. There is only Salisbury steak and shitty gravy. That's it. Every night. But you're aware that there's other things. But you can never choose any different. And those are demons. Also angels. That's a different frequency again. But we like to put words like that so we can understand the things that are really hard to wrap our heads around. We deceive ourselves about what it is. And when we go after it, we're going after a thing, what we think it is, but instead of by virtue of what it is, what it is. See why that's important to know truth? It's the most important thing. But we cherish our secrets because it allows us to have a mask and a facade so we can get what we want. Because if we don't get, we die. Are you still a fucking bacteria? Note, those are single cell organisms. We are single cell organisms all collaborated together because it took all of creation to make that it seem like a good idea. You know how long it took before that became a good idea? grow. And I'll leave it there in an hour. Oof. So I opened up. Ah, oh, that's full circle back to where I started. I opened up with uh, cups and being real. As real sits right there. Forgive yourself. It's a hard road. Don't be so hard. Don't be hard on others too, though. That's my resolve. And as an empress, wielding the light of creation, I'm going to do it fearlessly. So, if you're in a dark space, who's got you?